I just got back from my P.O. box and I found a mystery box inside of it. As I unwrapped this surprise mystery box, I saw that it came from another Pokemon card YouTuber named Legendary Lee. He wanted us to open up this box of cards and see what kind of crazy pulls we could get, but not only that, give it away to subscribers here on the channel. So I think you guys know the drill. If you'd like to enter the giveaway, all I have to do is number one, smash the like button. Number two, make sure you subscribe to the channel with notifications on. And number three, leave a comment down below in the comment section and make sure you check out Legendary Lee, linked down below in the description oh my god we got a mystery box this is gonna be awesome it's next to me i'm just gonna randomly grab things out let's see what the first item is oh wait i feel like i've never have i ever opened this before there's no way i had to have opened this right i genuinely don't remember this product ever existing this is champion's path but it's a pin collection box maybe i missed this one but um, there's three packs, dude. I haven't opened Champions Path in forever. I really don't remember this. Guys, remind me if we opened this before or not. But maybe I'm finally losing my mind here and I'm just not I'm just forgetting stuff. But I guess we're just going to shred into this thing and uh, let's check it out. Legendary Lee, you're a legend for setting this over again, by the way. I really appreciate it. Did not have to do that at all, but we're going to have fun with this. We have Eldegross as our uh, card here, a holo card. And then we get this really cool pin uh, that goes with it as well. But not only that... We get three packs of Champion's Path. Okay. Oh, and a code card as well. So Champion's Path, do I need to remind you? There's a couple of big hitter Charizards and everybody wants to pull that. But that's pretty much all anybody ever wants to pull from Champion's Path is going to be the char the two Charizards, the rainbow and the shiny. So let's see if we can get it from one of these three booster packs today. I can't wait to see what else is in this mystery box. We have a Venusaur V to start off. A nice little pick up here and get all the pools going away to one subscriber. All right, I don't know why I'm opening cards in a hoodie. This is just going to make things even more sweaty, so I might have to take this off a little bit. I don't know. It gets hot in here. It actually gets really hot in here because of all the lights and the... I got a computer running. I actually have, like, three cameras. I got the... Uh, yeah, just a lot of heat. And then I'm, like, a furnace myself. I'm, like... I am always feel like I'm hot. Kakuna and Altaria. I'm sweating already. Why did I do this? All right, so third pack of Champions Path. Let's become champions and not go down the wrong path, please. Come on. All right, Kakuna, Trubbish, Inkay, and to a Marnie regular hollow. Not bad. The Venusaur pickup was pretty good. Let's see what else is in this box. Ooh, okay. The first partner pack. So includes two Pokemon booster packs. I don't know if you guys have ever seen these before, but it's pretty cool because it's different um, jumbo cards that you get inside of these. And there's a bunch of different versions. I do not remember what's what or what you get. But let's see. Oh, here's our packs. We got Vivid Voltage. Oh, and Sun and Moon Base Set. Throwing it back to Sun and Moon. Okay, but which, which car? Oh, hold up. Oh, my God. Do we get all three starters? Do we get all three? We got Krooky. Score Bunny. It has 25th anniversary stamp on there. And we do got, we have the Sobble as well. The lineup. All right, choose, choose your favorite starter. But luckily for us, we're going back to the Sun and Moon era with Sun and Moon Base Set. So let's see how we do on this one. Um, I almost showed the code card color for some reason. I don't know why I almost did that, but let's go back in time. Let's take a trip down memory lane back to when there was just sun and moons, no storm shields, no scarlets and violets, and nothing. You'd imagine I'd have better luck. Maybe. Okay. Vivid Voltage is going to be the one that brings us the goods here. Four from the back to the front on that one. Let's see how we do here. Matang. Come on, Beldum. I want to see something cool. Old lady, that's not that cool. That's kind of cool. Took his V, all right. Our second pull of the day, pretty much. It's going to be our second V card anyway. We got somebody's lunch baggie. Oh, there's a peanut butter and jelly sandwich in here. I'm starving. What do we got? Oh, dude, it's the McDonald's packs. There's five of them in here. And there's, I think it's, okay. So these are the ones that come with all the other stuff, right? Let's check this out. Okay, so we'll pop this. Ooh, okay. So we got our little activity thing here. And then we have our one pack. We have a little thing to put the cards in. I remember these. Okay, and then a little maze. Can't look there or you'll just, it'll, it'll just tell you how to do it right there. Cover that up. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'll just open up maybe one or two of these packs and save the other ones as sealed because, oh, Chimchar. Because there's not a ton of pulls, and these are kind of cool to keep sealed, honestly. We got Chimchar on that one. Froki, Cyndaquil, and Rallet. All right, let's go back into our lunchbox bag. Okay, we'll do one more here. Save the rest. And then we'll do this one. So it's the same setup. Oh, this one's a little zigzag thingy. Connect the thing, but don't look at that. Okay, we'll put that to the side. We'll get one more and see what our hollow is. It's going to be Tepig. Tepig, Froakie, Totodile, and Sobble. 
Very cool. Anybody else ready for a new set of Pokemon cards to release? I know we just had one, but like, I'm already ready for another one. More Pokemon cards! Oh, dude, this is one of my favorite collection boxes that was released in the past, what, like four years? Dude, let's go. This one hits perfect. And the crazy thing is, there's a Cosmic Eclipse back in here. There's an insanely cool Arceus figure, a really beautiful Arceus promo card, a bunch of other really good packs. This is like one of my favorite collection boxes, like I said, in the past four years or so. And it has like this cool galaxy texture on the side here or whatever. Um, this one's cool. I think it was released in 2021 or 2022 or something like that. Um, let's crack this one open. I don't even know what these go for anymore. Um, maybe a price will pop up on the screen. I'm not sure, but they're they're pretty cool. When you have a collection box where everything hits perfectly, like the promo card, the other bonus stuff, the packs, like this is this is why I like this one a lot. All right, let's pop this open here. Let's check out the stuff. First of all, we got to check out. Okay, yep, yep, that's just gonna happen. But we're gonna check out this figure, which looks really good. It's a nice quality, and it's RCS. I mean, it, it's just really good. Now I have to fix this. We have no budget for the studio, okay? We just have the budget for Pokemon cards. But check this out. Oh my god, dude, this is amazing, this artwork. Arceus with all these Pokemon just like chilling, sitting there with a beautiful mountain in the background. That is a really good artwork. I'm going to put that one to the side in the, the stack of all the pulls because we got a lot. And we hopefully got more. Two, not one, but two Brilliant Stars packs. A chilling rain booster pack. And yes, there is a Cosmic Eclipse booster pack in here. I don't know how much these go for now. Probably like $15, $20, something like that. They go for a lot now. All in this Arceus box. Okay, as you can see, this is a pretty solid lineup. I gotta say. What I want to do is, I'll start off with chilling rain. Because um, we're going to be crying after we open this up with no pull. I'm just going to, just that's my guess. Brilliant stars, I feel like we're going to get something pretty solid. And Cosmic is where we're going to get the win. Here we go. The four lineup. All right, here we go. Come on. Curlia. Clara. Porygon. Heracross. Sobble. Inke. Blitzel. Calyrex V. We actually got a pull. All right, moving up. We have the Charizard Brilliant Stars pack. One of my favorites from the Sword and Shield era. Let's see how we do on this one. Are we ready? Fire Energy. Nice. Gloria. Gibble. Turtwig. Trap Inch. Piplop. Gloria. And the Tornadus, baby. Okay. We have Brilliant Stars. RCS artwork up next here. Here's where we get some goodies. Okay. Ready? So, we're going to go four on that one. And yeah, I don't know. I'm just ready for a new set of Pokemon cards. I'm sorry if they Fates is cool, but we still have to complete it, I know. But while we're doing that, why don't we just get the new sets? Come on. Come on, Pokemon. Shroomish. Oh. And now, one of the main events is going to be a Cosmic Eclipse Booster Pack. A Supreme Connection of Stars of Pokemon. You don't really care about that. You just want to see what's inside of this pack. I know. All right. As do I. Let's see how we do here. We're going to go four on that one. Cosmic Eclipse. Bring me to the moon, baby. Bring me back. I just... What was that? Oh. Celio. Gloom. Zangoose. Rockruff. Vulpix. Piplup. We're doing... We're, 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 we got nothing. We got nothing. <sighs> All right. I can't win. Well, let's try on the next item. It looks like there's a 151 booster bundle here. Let's go, dude. Okay. Now, this is a nice set. And it's a nice way to open it up. Because it's all in this compact booster bundle, baby. Look at this. Ching. One, two, three, four, five, six. The first pack will have the magic. Watch the hands. First pack magic. All right. How do we open Scarlet and Violet again? I forget. We don't need to do pack tricks. Give me the banger. Okay. We got, we got too excited on that. Let's try the second pack, though. Give us the special illustration rare. Ooh, what's this say? Venusaur, Ivysaur, nice, and a Nido King. Well, that's a beautiful card. We got a starter Ivysaur. Okay, four more 151 packs. Let's make them count. Okay, I'll give the code card like that, and we'll just go straight through it. Goldeen, 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 Ghastly. We got Paris. Persian, Snorlax, right on, Mewtwo, nice hollow, and then we got that energy hollow. Legendary Lee, bless us with this pack. You already did, but now give us a hit on this one. Cubone, come on, Magnemite and Caterpie, this is all Gen 1. Meowth into a Starmie hollow. All right, all right, two more 151 packs. 
If you guys don't know about 151, if you're into the OG Pokemon, if you like the old school stuff, right here is where you want to be. Firo, Magneton, Weezing, no. And actually, if you're just getting back into Pokemon cards from like base set, like, and you just see hollows just flying everywhere, and you're just wondering like why nobody cares that much about them, it's because, well, there's a lot bigger types of cards that you could pull nowadays. Erica's Invitation, ditto. Into the Charizard, full art, nice. All right, there we go. That's the pull of the day so far. To all the OG kids out there that were looking for the Charizard, I got you right here. This is going out. We're still moving through it, and now we have a Verizian V. I just was checking to see if I was filming, because I was like, I, sometimes I freak out, and I look, and I'm like, am I filming? There's a couple times when I was filming, and my mic was off. That was the worst. I just had to basically delete the video. And there was like um, maybe one or two times when I wasn't filming at all. So I didn't even have a video. So every time, I, I, like once in a while, I'll look over just to make sure. I see a little red recording button there that to know that everything's okay, that I didn't just sit here and talk to myself, even though I kind of am talking to myself. But if I don't put it on YouTube, then I really am talking to myself. But anyway, let's see what's inside of it. We got the Verizian V, so there's gonna be the Verizian V and then the Keldeo. I'll show you guys a closer look there. I'm sure that not, not, bleh, not that many people actually care about that card. But we do get the Jumbo version as well. We're gonna put that to the side. Oh no, Jumbo version bent, very bad, very bad. <laughs> I don't know how that happened. It wasn't me. Okay, so the pack's in here. Ooh, nice. Two Lost Origin. That's one of my faves. We got Fusion Strike. Very cool with the Gengar. And then we have Astral Radiance. But we also do have a code card going out. I'm going to start this one off with a Lost Origin. Big pull right now. Let's go. Okay. We're going to go four from the back. Let's follow up that Charizard that we just pulled. Here we go. Give me the Aerodactyl. The best card ever. That's a dugong. Lost Origin, give me the best card ever. The alternate artwork, Aerodactyl, V-Star Marker, get out of here. Okay, we got Poor God 2, Misfortune Sisters, Gla Rhyhorn, Burkrow, into, oh, Rotom V4, okay, that's pretty solid. All right, we did get a little something something. We'll take it, it's a full art. It's actually probably one of the better pulls today, if I do say so myself. But now we have Fusion Strike and Astral Radiance. Fusion Strike. All right, we're doing pretty good. We're doing pretty good. We got a bunch of full arts. We got some illustration rares. We got some V cards. We got a bunch of promo cards. We got some goods. All right, but let's see how we do. Diggersby, Sydney, come on. Let's see if we get anything in this pack. It's a Blissey, not Hollow. You know what? That's fine because we have one more pack today. It's going to be Astral Radiance. Shout out to Legendary Lee for hooking us up and giving this out for, uh, yeah, thank you so much for doing that. You did not have to do that. We appreciate it. And let's see if we can end it with a banger. Okay, I'm ready. Here we go. Last pack magic. We have a gutsy pickaxe, pretty gutsy. We got a rufflet, you're pretty gutsy. Ponyta, Chatot, Bronzor, Chatot. Back again, I see. And the final card is an Arcanine to end. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching the video. If you enjoyed it, make sure to smash the like button on your way out. If you want more content, click on one of the two videos at the top there. Hit that subscribe button as well. And as always, I hope you have a great day, and I will see you on the next one.